hello students today we are going to solve a problem on calibration of meter and bars so here what they have given they have given the actual length of a calibrated meter bar that is 1000.003 mm and it is used to calibrate two other bars that is bar a and bar b of basic length so these two bars have the length of 500 mm when compared with the meter bar la plus lb see here in this figure we can see that la plus lb each has 500 mm length and the difference with this meter bar is given as x1 that is 0.0002 mm okay now when we compare these two bars that is bar a and bar b we see that bar a is found longer than bar b how long it is it is denoted by x2 that is 0.0004 mm so now we will write down all the given data so capital l that is the actual length of the calibrated bar is 1000.0003 mm and l a that is length of the bar a is 500 mm l b is given as 500 mm as well now x1 that is the difference between these two bars combined together and the actual meter bar that is x1 is given as 0.0002 mm and x2 is given as 0.0004 mm so now we can say that l minus x1 will give us la plus lb from this figure see this is l minus this x1 will give us la plus lb and la can be written as lb plus x2 so this is la if you add x2 to lb we will get la let us consider this as equation 1 and this is equation 2 now what do we do we substitute this equation 2 in equation 1 that is l minus x1 is equal to instead of la we are writing lb plus x2 plus lb so what do we get 2lb plus x2 so 2lb can be written as l minus x1 minus x2 therefore lb becomes l minus x1 minus x2 divided by now substituting the values lb is equal to 1000.0003 minus 0.0002 minus 0.0004 divided by 2 so lb we get the value as 499.85 mm so this is the actual length of this bar b now from equation 2 that is la can be written as lb plus x2 so LA's actual value can be found by 
499.99985 plus 0 0.0004 so value of LA becomes 500.00025 mm this way we have found the actual length of bar A and bar 